Hi, I'm Joachim for Statistics Globe and in this video I'll explain how to change the colors of the bars in a ggplot2 bar plot. So in the video I'm going to show you an example and this example is based on the data frame that we can create with lines 2 to 3 of the code. So if you run these lines of code you can see at the top right of RStudio that a new data frame object appears which is called data and we can click on this data object to see the structure of our data frame and then you can see that our data contains two columns x and y whereby the x column is showing the groups or the different bars of our plot and the y column is showing the height of our bars. So if we want to draw these data with the ggplot2 package we also need to install and load the ggplot2 package as you can see in lines 5 and 6 of the code. I have installed the package already so I'm just going to load it with line 6 of the code. And after running this line of code, we are able to use the functions of the ggplot2 package such as ggplot and geombar. So if you run lines 8 and 9 of the code, you can see that a new bar plot has been created at the bottom right of our studio. And as you can see, this bar plot does not contain any colors yet. So if we want to color the bars of our bar plot, we can apply the fill argument within the aesthetics of our ggplot to plot and to the fill argument we simply need to specify the value x because the value x is containing the groups of our bars. So if you run lines 11 and 12 of the code you can see at the bottom right of our studio that our plot is updated and this time each bar has a different color and you can also see that at the right side of our plot a legend has been created which is showing the colors that correspond to the groups of our data. So in this example, I have shown you how to use the default color palette of the ggplot2 package. However, it is also possible to specify the colors of our bars manually. And this is what I want to show you in the next example in lines 14 to 20 of the code. And in these lines of code, I'm adding to our previous code the scale fill manual function. And within this function, I'm specifying the values that I want to add to our colors. And to the values argument, I'm assigning a vector that is specifying a color for each of our bars. So if you run lines 14 to 20 of the code, you can see that our plot is updated again. And this time we have specified the colors of our bar plot manually. As you can see, we have specified the same color for two of our bars, in this case red. So you can see that here in lines 18 and 19 of the code, we have specified the color red twice. So it is also possible to use the same color for multiple bars in your bar plot. So in this video, I have explained how to modify the colors of a bar plot created by the ggplot2 package in the R programming language. However, in case you want to learn more on this topic, you could check out my homepage statisticsglobe.com because on the homepage, I have recently published a tutorial in which I'm explaining the content of this video in some more detail. Furthermore, I will put a link to this tutorial into the description of the video so you can check it out there. And furthermore, if you have liked this video, I would be very happy if you leave me some positive feedback in the comments. And make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to get notifications in future when I'm releasing new videos to the channel. That's it for this video. Thanks a lot. See you next time. Bye bye.